Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. It's Roberta here, Fashion Over 50. And if you're new, I just wanted to explain what my channel is all about. Um, I'm 58 years old and on the channel I try to, hopefully, um, show ladies our age how to style certain pieces a certain way that's appropriate for our um, age group, plus to keep us current and on trend. So today I, I just wanted to show you these boots I just received. Um, I actually got them from, um, the make is Leonard Max. I actually bought them from Zoo Lily and I haven't really purchased too many things from Zoo Lily in the past, but I saw these and I thought, oh, I'll go for it. So anyway, they came beautifully packaged. There's a dust bag for storage, which I think is very nice. Uh, they all came really nicely packaged, inserts, so you can keep their shape. They're suede, they're a low heel, and they have a stretch insert in here. And I didn't have anything, and they're a slightly pointed toe, not super pointy, but, you know, a nice size, uh, nice toe shape, and a full zipper, so easy to get on and off. They were 100% um, uh, suede leather the sole is leather as well and they have a nice insert here so you're an anti-skid insert so you're not going to slide around too much and like I said they did come beautifully packaged tissue paper and each boot beautifully packaged and really nicely nice you know really nice condition they came in so I'm just going to style up these boots a couple of ways and I'm going to show you how to wear high boots, but also how to wear some other shorter boots, but I'm going to show you the correct way and the right way, and the wrong way to wear boots. Anyway, I hope you'll stay tuned. I'm just going to just style these up in a couple of different ways for you. Be right back. Okay, so I'm back with a look that I think is quite casual. I'm just wearing a cream colored um, Banana Republic sweater, and this is just a long vest. Um, sweater vest really that I've had for a number of years and I'm actually wearing these really high-waisted kind of baggy um, black kind of coated they have like a coating on them um, pants from Zara they're like a jean but I'm also wearing I'm wearing the boots underneath the pants because I wanted to have a solid line between the boot and the pants I didn't want to have a gap there in between the end of the pants and the start of the boots and these boots are perfect for that these pants are a little bit baggy and but they're casual so that's why i wanted to have these long line boots i think they look great with these pants um the the tone because they are suede they have a different texture than the pants but they give you a long clean line so it makes your leg look longer than if there was a break at the hem between the pants and the boot. I hope that's a clearer explanation, but that's what you want. You want to have the clean, long line of between the pants and the top of your boot. And I think these boots do that trick. Anyway, these what I call, I call these pants my, my Zara kind of funky pants because they were a little bit funky for me, but I really wore these a lot um, last winter and I, plan on wearing them a lot this year too. They're super comfortable. They, they, actually, the waist is stretchy as well, so they're actually really good. Anyway, this is how one way I would style these boots with a slimmer, shorter pant, but the continuous line uh, keeps the color consistent, and I think it makes, it makes all the difference in the world. So I'm going to try with a different pair of pants and also with a skirt, so stay tuned for that. Okay, I'm back with just a little tip. These boots that I'm wearing right now are the wrong style boot to be wearing with this kind of pant. You want it to have a continuous um, non-break between the top of the boot or the end of the pant and the top of the boot. You don't want to see this gap. That's what I was alluding to about the right and wrong way to, to wear a boot. It's not that there's anything wrong with these boots. They just don't go with this sort of pant. And also the previous pants that I showed you, the ones from Zara that are a bit cropped as well. 
they wouldn't go with that either because they're too short. But if you have a long line boot and you have the continuous line, then you have the continuous non break in your pants. Like if these look with the break there, it makes your legs look shorter than they are. And they, you don't want that. You want a continuous line. Anyway, that's what I meant about the right and wrong way for a boot. And you'll see when, when I have the correct boots on, how much better it looks. So just look at that video, that portion of the video, you'll see it looks a lot better. Okay, so I'm back with a bit of a wider leg trouser on. And these are like a, a, a nice dress pant, they're wool. And I just have, it has a nice, uh, I don't know if you can see that on the camera, a, a little stitch of white down the side. I'm just wearing it with um, just a plain cashmere um, gray sweater. And then I just put this wrap on just to even out the top half with the more voluminous pants. But I think the, the little boots, because the heel isn't so high and the, the structure of the boot is more streamlined, I think it looks great with these pants. And like I said, it's just, I'm just wearing it with this little scarf, a little turnover scarf. And I think they look great with this. So I'm just going to show you what it looks like with some, a skirt. And then you can, uh, that'll be my final look. So stay tuned for that. Okay, so here's my last look. I just wanted to show you what these boots look like with my leather skirt. Now I've had this long leather skirt for a number of years. And I just put on, I wanted it to make it um, casual because this really is a casual pair of boots. They're not super dressy boots. They're a casual pair of boots. So I just wanted to, I put on my favorite Banana Republic hoodie and I just did a half tuck into my long leather skirt and here are the boots. And I think they look great with it. It gives a little bit of texture, a different texture than if I was wearing all leather boots, the suede. And then you get, like I said, the stretchy side pieces come through and have another little different contrast. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed this short video on my new little boots and thinking of wearing some of your leather pieces with boots and doing it in a casual way like I've done here. It's, it makes them a little bit more versatile. So this is, you could totally dress up a leather skirt, but you don't need to with the right accessories. And like I said, a little cross body bag. And also, I mean, I could simply add a scarf to this as well. So, and you got a nice casual fall winter look. Thanks a lot for watching this short video. And if you did like it, I would really appreciate if you would subscribe and give me a big thumbs up. Anyway, we'll see you next time and have a great rest of your day. Talk to you later. Bye for now.